hallway is coming from the uh, monorail and parking garage. This store's been here forever. Believe it or not, these hats are not bad quality. I've got one. It's I've had one for 10 years, and I think the price was $3.99 back then. This bar is typically open in the summertime. Right out that door is the Flamingo Gardens. Lobby is nice. The check-in here is very slow for some reason. I don't understand it. Wow. So, Piff. P-I-F-F, -F, the magic dragon. I think this is year number five for him. I can't imagine why. I don't get it. But I haven't seen the show, so... Evidently, it's good. Doesn't seem like it would be, but, you know. Here's the sports book. Or, I should say, the 747. Everybody, please be seated so we can take off. Buckle your seat belts. This is probably one of the most under remodeled sports books in the whole area. and Charlie's. This is very good. This is a very good Mexican bar, uh, restaurant and bar. Very good food. Not all that crazy priced either. It's, it's, it's fairly reasonable. to the Link Promenade, Bugsy and Meyer Steakhouse, highly, highly rated. It's right down the hallway, and the, over to the right is the Flamingos. say that the uh, cocktail service in Flamingo is better than most. Everything you need in a food court, subs, Asian, Johnny Rockets, pizza, 
those are the four uh, food groups. So they've gone up on price pretty drastically. But everything has. We just have to live with it. showing a drag show RuPaul this was the Donnie and Marie showroom when they were here they would come right out here and talk to people for hours they were very hands-on All the craps tables, the like the new electronic one. That's a twenty-five dollar minimum table there. Or the real, the old-fashioned, but it's a crapless table. So. Poker. Hardly know her. Bugsy's bar. Always gotten really good service at Bugsby's. Bugsy's. Margaritaville starting here, but I'm not sure if it is anymore. This is still part of Flamingo. Don't see anything about Margaritaville anymore. I still see there's a shop down there, Margaritaville. But I'm not sure that they have anything to do with the casino anymore. They actually have a good happy hour here for beer pong. You can get pretty drunk for about seven dollars. This used to be uh, blackjack and yeah, the blackjack tables. So I'm thinking that Margaritaville has nothing to do with this anymore. Yeah, that bar, that bar in the summertime flows out into Las Vegas Boulevard. It's very, very nice and very, very crowded. But in the wintertime, it's not. Okay, so we still got this big drink up here with Margaritaville on it. And there's the Margaritaville gift shop. But I kind of think that the 
casino has nothing to do with Margaritaville anymore. But you can see there's no theming. There used to be paintings on the wall with Margaritaville. So I would say no more Margaritaville. Okay, that's it.